Welcome to our fascinating journey into the world of carnivorous plants. In the diverse tapestry of life on Earth, few things are quite as intriguing as a plant that hunts. These botanical marvels have turned the tables on the animal kingdom, evolving ingenious ways to lure, trap and consume their prey. Get ready to uncover some mind-blowing facts about these incredible predators of the plant kingdom. Prepare to be amazed by their cunning strategies, their remarkable adaptations, and the sheer brilliance of nature's design. Our exploration begins in the humid bogs and savannas of North and South Carolina, home to one of the most iconic carnivorous plants, the Venus flytrap. Imagine, if you will, a plant that can strike with the speed of a blink, its leaves transformed into snapping jaws. The Venus flytrap's trapping mechanism is a marvel of evolution. Its leaves are lined with tiny trigger hairs, so sensitive that the slightest touch can spring the trap. When an unsuspecting insect, perhaps a fly drawn in by the plant's sweet nectar, lands on the open leaf, it brushes against these hairs. If a single hair is touched twice in quick succession, or if two hairs are triggered simultaneously, the trap snaps shut in less than a tenth of a second. The unsuspecting prey is now imprisoned within the interlocking teeth that line the edges of the leaf. Over the next few days, the Venus flytrap's digestive juices break down the insect's soft tissues, releasing vital nutrients that the plant absorbs. This macabre yet fascinating process is a testament to the ingenuity of nature and the lengths to which plants will go to thrive in nutrient-poor environments. Our journey into the world of carnivorous plants takes us now to the tropical rainforests of Southeast Asia, home to the pitcher plant. Unlike the lightning-fast reflexes of the Venus flytrap, the pitcher plant relies on a more passive form of trapping. It's a strategy of seduction and deception. The pitcher plant gets its name from its pitcher-shaped leaves, which are essentially death traps for unsuspecting insects. The plant secretes a sweet, fragrant nectar along the rim of its pitcher, an irresistible lure for insects. As an insect alights on the slippery rim, enticed by the promise of a sugary meal, it loses its footing and tumbles into the depths of the pitcher. Downward pointing hairs lining the inside of the pitcher prevent the insect from climbing back up. The hapless creature struggles in vain against the slick, waxy walls, eventually succumbing to exhaustion and drowning in the pool of digestive fluids at the bottom. These fluids are a potent cocktail of enzymes, bacteria, and even small organisms that help break down the insect's body, releasing a nourishing soup of nutrients that the pitcher plant readily absorbs. Prepare to be mesmerized as we venture into the world of the sundew plant, a master of sticky seduction. Found in bogs, marshes and other wet habitats around the world, sundews are instantly recognizable by their glistening traps. Imagine a plant adorned with hundreds of tiny shimmering dewdrops, each one a deadly trap for unsuspecting insects. These glistening droplets aren't dew at all, but a sticky substance called mucilage, secreted by specialized glands on the plant's tentacles. The mucilage sparkles in the sunlight, attracting insects with its sweet aroma and jewel-like appearance. But this beauty is a deadly illusion. As an insect lands on a sundew's tentacle, drawn in by the promise of a sugary treat, it becomes ensnared in the sticky mucilage. The more the insect struggles, the more entangled it becomes, triggering the sundew's tentacles to slowly curl inward, further tightening their grip on the helpless prey. The sundew then secretes digestive enzymes that break down the insect's body, converting it into a nutrient-rich soup that the plant absorbs through its tentacles. Our exploration of carnivorous plants takes us now beneath the surface of still ponds and waterways where we encounter the bladderwort, a master of aquatic ambush. Don't be fooled by its delicate appearance and seemingly harmless nature, for the bladderwort is a predator with a remarkable hunting strategy. This submerged plant possesses small, bladder-like traps along its underwater stems, sophisticated traps that operate like miniature vacuum cleaners. These bladders are hollow, with a tiny trap door at one end. Imagine a vacuum, but instead of sucking in air, it sucks in water, along with any unsuspecting prey unfortunate enough to trigger the trap. The bladderwort creates a vacuum by pumping water out of the bladder, lowering the internal pressure. When a small aquatic creature, perhaps a water flea or mosquito larva, brushes against trigger hairs located near the trap door, the bladder springs open. 
The sudden change in pressure sucks the unsuspecting prey into the bladder, along with a rush of water. The trapdoor snaps shut in a fraction of a second, trapping the prey inside. Digestive enzymes are then released, breaking down the prey and providing the bladderwort with the nutrients it needs to thrive in its watery environment. Our journey culminates with one of the most visually stunning and cunning carnivorous plants, the cobra lily. This plant, found in bogs and seeps along the Pacific coast of North America, is named for its striking resemblance to a cobra poised to strike. Imagine a pitcher plant, but with a twist. The cobra lily's tubular leaves, reaching up to two feet in height, are topped with a hooded structure that resembles a cobra's head, complete with a forked tongue. This striking appearance isn't just for show. The cobra lily's hood is lined with translucent windows that confuse and disorient insects that venture inside. Lured in by the promise of nectar secreted deep within the pitcher, insects become trapped in a labyrinth of false exits. The hood's translucent windows allow light to penetrate, giving the insects the illusion of an escape route. But as they repeatedly fly towards the light, they become increasingly disoriented and exhausted, eventually falling into the pitcher's depths. The cobra lily's pitcher, like those of other pitcher plants, contains a pool of digestive fluids that break down the trapped insects providing the plant with essential nutrients. The cobra lily, with its captivating appearance and ingenious trapping mechanism, is a testament to the incredible diversity and adaptability of the plant kingdom. Thanks for joining us on this incredible journey into the world of carnivorous plants. We've witnessed the lightning-fast reflexes of the Venus flytrap, the deceptive allure of the pitcher plant, the sticky traps of the sundew, the underwater vacuum of the bladderwort, and the cunning design of the cobra lily. These botanical marvels, each with their unique adaptations and hunting strategies, showcase the incredible diversity and ingenuity of the natural world. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more amazing nature facts.